welcome back to Mandy Loves Japan. It's been a couple of weeks. We've been setting up house and doing all sorts of amazing things, getting our little life sorted here. Um, but we want to get right back into it and we want to show you a few of the weird and wonderful things that we found in the grocery store while shopping for our daily supplies. So we have some spreads here that are designed to go on uh, bread, toast, that sort of thing. And we haven't tried these before. Uh, we just picked these up because they looked interesting. So you guys are going to be witnessing our very first taste test mm. of these four amazing spreads. So a couple of them, um, they say to toast the bread and then toast the spread on the bread first, which is interesting. So we have pre-prepared that. Um, and here we go. So this is the first one. Um, I don't know what it says. Um, and Mandy can read some of these, but I've asked her not to tell me what they are because I want the surprise. Um, but that looks to me like a pile of butter with maybe some sauce or jam or something. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> so... Let's go and see how we go. It doesn't Kanpai. look like much on it. Oh. That's um, salty. Mmm. That's almost like a sour cream and chives flavour. Oh, yeah, that's what it is. That's um, what it tastes like. I don't think that that's what it's supposed to be. No. So it says butter shoyu, which to me indicates it's a mixture of butter and soy sauce. Uh -huh. Um, but I get no soy in there or butter for that matter. There's definitely a sour cream sort of a flavor. Yeah, it's, it's like a whipped, um, spread. It does look like a dip. <clears throat> mm. It just looks like a genuine and, Australian dip that you would put on a Jats cracker. And it's surprisingly grainy when you spread it. It's, yeah, it's not a smooth texture. Lots of grains in that, but, um. It's not unpleasant at all. It's it's very mild. No. Yeah. But definitely the sort of thing that you'd have on a Jack's cracker. Mm. Mm. Um, mm. Yeah, a bit of a <clears throat> surprise when you're expecting a sweet breakfast spread. Um, now this one, I can't read the writing on it, but I, I can tell you that the image certainly looks like some curry. And when you take the lid off, there is no question. Oh, wow. That's curry. That's definitely curry. Um, Keen's yeah. curry powder vibes. Oh, well, I just get like golden curry, uh, Japanese curry flavor. No, I reckon it's more like a Keen's curry. That, yeah. Oh, well, <clears throat> this one, there's a lot more color in it. So this is the one that you had to toast first? Yes. Well, no, no, no. This is, this is one of the three that you toast the spread on there. Oh. So you spread it, then toast it. Mm. Oh wow. That's curry. Sweet. Oh, mm. spice. Yeah? Yep, it's got a, it's got like the afterburn. Is it? <laughs> Just a little. That was so, really good. Mm, lovely flavour. Um, so this actually says um, otona no kare. So otona means adult, adult curry. Um, and it's got a little thing here that indicates that it's spicy. Mm -hmm. So this, um, it's also says saku saku, <clears throat> which is like, um, like the sound that you make when you're chewing toast and stuff. So it's, um, yeah, it's quite cute and it does taste really good. Mm. It's like that sweet curry flavor. Very nice. I need just a little bit of water just to get rid of some of that curry flavor before the next one. I don't know what the next one is. It's brown. Um, yeah, in Australia, you would obviously assume that this is chocolate, but this is Japan, and so never assume. Never assume. The rule is never assume. <clears throat> um, it looks looks kind of like um, watered down Nutella. Yeah, maybe. Or maybe off Vegemite. Off Vegemite. You're really selling this. <laughs> Grainy. Mm. Like sugary grains. Mm. Like you would have on cinnamon toast, but it doesn't taste like cinnamon toast. It's 
There's not much flavor there. I think it's got a little bit of cocoa flavor in it. Like I think it's a mm. little bit of chocolate, but it's mostly just sugar. Yeah, there's, there's not much flavor in that. I, I think it's trying to be chocolate, but uh, got lost somewhere. But yeah, it's like the grains <clears> of sugar, <throat> like you would have on a cinnamon toast. Yeah, yeah, Interesting. not bad. Yeah. This last one is um, uh, the only one that didn't ask to be toasted. So I hope I wasn't supposed to. Um, this, there's a hint of the chocolate from the knife, but it, it's just, it looks like whipped cream sort of to me, so. Could look like a dip, I suppose. All right. All right, let's try this. Oh, gee. Ooh. Tastes like marshmallow. Mm. Like a really mild, not overly sweet marshmallow. Um, I was thinking like the um, fluff spread that you can get in the States. Oh, yeah. Yeah, very similar. Not as sweet though. Not as sweet. I like it better because it's not as sweet. Mm. So this one um, on the lid there, it says whipped cream whipped cream so and it and the flavor is milk milk so um yeah milk flavored cream milk flavored cream that's a fair place to start Fumwari. so it's fluffy so yeah all right what's your <clears throat> what's your pick from the four um i'd say that last one the um marshmallowy one mm. it wasn't too sweet there's a good bit of flavor in it the, the curry was nice, but it doesn't taste quite like real curry, and I really like good curry. Um, the chocolate or whatever that other one was just didn't have much flavour. Kind of a bit ordinary. Um, and that that first one was just a bit mediocre. So yeah, that that fluffy one was my was my pick. I think um, if I was just gonna have like toast with a bit of butter, because I do actually like that mm. as a breakfast, I think I'd probably choose this over just a straight butter. Just for mm. a little bit of extra flavor. Um, for a dessert, absolutely the whipped cream one all the way. But I really enjoyed the curry. I thought yeah. it had just a, like, at first I thought it was going to be too spicy, but it was actually just a really nice amount of spice, had a sweetness and a curry. Curry's my pick. Yeah. Fair enough. Yeah. Cool. All right. Thanks for watching. Johnny. Johnny.